Hey guys, it's Sarah. Welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are all doing amazing. So if you guys are anything like me, you're obsessed with the dollar store. I love Dollar Tree, Dollar General, Family Dollar, and Five Below. So today I want to share with you guys why you should be shopping at Five Below, some of the best products, some things you should avoid, a few secrets, and at the end we're going to have a haul. So I hope that you guys enjoy. If you're new here, definitely consider subscribing. We're all about shopping on a budget and I would love to have you. Give the video a thumbs up if you like it. All right, y'all, let's get started. You see a lot of people comparing Five Below to Dollar Tree, and they are similar, but they are actually really different. Dollar Tree's been around since the 1980s. Five Below opened up their first store in 2002 right here in PA. The first store was in Wayne, PA, and they actually have a headquarters here in Philly. Just like Dollar Tree, they have a whole makeup and beauty section, but one of the best things about Five Below is they carry a whole line. So they have all wet and wild, all LA colors, so you won't just find like one or two sporadic things. You can go there and see a whole range of what they have from LA colors and wet and wild. One of my favorite things to get from Five Below is their fake nails. They have like the best press on nails. They have so much selection, so much variety. One area that Five Below does really well is the fitness section. You are not going to be able to go into another store and find an entire section of fitness equipment for as cheap as it is at Five Below. Resistance bands, balls to bounce on, things to step on, and have you seen the sports section? I swear when I go with my boys and my husband, we go straight to the back to the balls. They're bouncing the basketballs, they're throwing the footballs, and they're playing with all of the gear. Today we were even able to get a hockey stick and the little balls, and that was like the highlight of Little B's entire day. He got home, he opened it up, and he was already outside playing with it. I feel like one of the best kept secrets about Five Below is their electronics section. Nobody is doing it like Five Below is doing it when it comes to electronics at the price that they sell it at. You can find car mounts, car chargers, the chargers to charge your phone, they have LED lights, they have Bluetooth speakers, headphones that are Bluetooth as well, they have an entire section of gaming stuff, they have stuff for the Nintendo Switch, and even though some of the stuff might be over the $5 mark, I feel like you're never going to be able to go into a Family Dollar, a Dollar General, or a Dollar Tree and find the electronic stuff that you can find at Five Below. So many people are nervous about the electronics not working, maybe they're defective if you have it for a bit and then it stops working. Five Below says that you're able to exchange items that are unopened or defective without the receipt. So you can just walk it in there if the cord stops working and get the same exact one. If you save your receipt and the product is defective and you need to return it, you can actually get your money back as well. One area of Five Below that I think is a big thumbs down is their craft section. I don't think that it compares to Dollar Tree at all. Yes, they do have markers, crayons, colored pencils, pads of paper, paint brushes, all of that kind of stuff, but I'm talking about like yarn and string and beads. I don't think it compares in that sense. Yes, they do have this stuff, but every time I go into the craft section at Five Below, I kind of feel like it's eh, a little lackluster. Another reason why you should be shopping at Five Below is because they have the cutest sandals, t-shirts, little dresses, cute little lounge sets, all for about five dollars they have the cutest graphic t-shirts ever and even though they are geared to more teens and tweens we can we can get in them too i have no shame in my game i actually found the cutest little lounge set there it was pink and leopard it had long sleeves and little shorts it was only five dollars you cannot beat that with a bag i do hope one day they will up their sizing because their sizes are a little small but for now, I think you cannot beat the quality of what you're getting for the price that you're able to get it. While I was just in there shopping with the boys, I saw the cutest stuff for summer. They had cute little water shoes, sandals, boys bathing suits. They had tons of little beach bags. I feel like if you're going on vacation, you're in a pinch, you need to just run and get something that's affordable real quick. Five Below is the place to go. If your phone charger dies, Five Below is the place to go. If you need a quick gift for a friend and you're headed out the door, Five Below is the place to go. Things like that, like easy, convenient, budget friendly, they got it covered. So another reason what sets Five Below apart from other dollar stores is the way that you're able to shop online. Yes, you can shop online at Dollar Tree, but it's not the same as being able to buy one of something and have it shipped to you. Now, I've personally never shopped online for Five Below, so I'm not sure how the shipping time is, how fast it gets to you, but I can appreciate being able just to buy one of something and not having to buy 24. If you guys have shopped at FiveBelow.com, let me know how your experience was. Put it in the comment section down below. It not only helps me, but it helps other people that read through the comments and maybe thinking about placing an order. But they have tons and tons of items that you can find in store 
fall in line and I love that. It takes away from the aspect of it being a treasure hunt like it is when we shop at Dollar Tree but it's accessible to everybody and I think it's just in the US. I hate when I do a Dollar Tree haul and you guys are not able to get the items as well but if I buy something at Five Below I'm able to give you guys links by putting it in the description box and if it's in stock you're able to purchase it by shopping online. Now the last and final reason why I personally love to shop at Five Below is because of their candy section. Every single time I go into a Five Below store before we're about to leave, I literally raid the candy section. You think Dollar Tree has good candy? Yes, they do. They have a good selection, a good price. It's all a dollar. But Five Below has Pocky. They have like the little um, SpongeBob cheeseburgers. They have candy that you don't typically see and I absolutely love that. Before COVID hit, you would be able to find so many more like Asian based snacks and candies which was so fun to try. All right, you guys, so here's our little Five Below haul. I just wanted to share with you guys the stuff that I picked up. The kids for the most part picked up the majority of the stuff. B got a little hockey stick. You got the little balls. They got these little fidget things. I'll show you guys pictures of those. I found this super cute little visor style hat. I'm like, oh. It's like super duper covers my face. Like, hello, can you see me? You may not know who I am. Oh my God. I just love the material. So you guys know that Dollar Tree makes like a placemat that looks just like this. If Dollar Tree made placemats in this material in black, they would be golden. So this is just a little visor style hat. And I think that was, I think it was $5. Yeah, basically everything's like $5. A Five Below did have quite a few $6 to $10 items. I'm not sure how I feel about that, but if the value is there, then hey. So next up, I got these Hershey's Cookies and Cream Dipped Pretzels. I thought that they would taste different. They're basically just like a white chocolate pretzel with a, like a dusting of chocolate on there. They were pretty good. Little B liked them a lot, and I thought they were decent. So I saw my friend on TikTok, a girl that I follow on TikTok, shared this Freeman it's called flirty feet instant foot peeling spray so someone said that it was a forget it like don't get it but she actually loved it so i'm excited to try it basically it takes all the dead skin off your feet and then right next to it it was the same flirty feet saw it foot scrubber this is an exfoliating and detoxifying basically like a little soap so i'm going to use the two of these together and i'll post my results at the end of the video just in case you're curious because my feet look like I've been walking outside for the past 100 years, like not cute. We have the watermelon hint. I absolutely love this stuff. It's so good. And I think it was just $1.25. And then in the room section, I am absolutely obsessed with the room decor section at Five Below. They have a really good variety of stuff, like cute little decorative pillows. That you, they also had sheets there, but I thought this little bin would be perfect for in the bathroom to put extra toilet paper. It was only $5 and it is cute. It's like a wired basket that has kind of like raffia like wrapped around. If you focus your eyes right there, I got this little stand. This is a metal stand that they had. It's also, it was also only $5, so we picked that up. Before I let you go, I wanna let you guys know that I have a giveaway going on in this video over here. Click the link that's in the description box below if you guys want to join. And also, your girl started a podcast. It's called The Sensational Social Hour. It's basically just an hour of conversation, motivation, and inspiration just to connect. It's kind of like a little community that I'm trying to form, and I hope that you guys would go take a listen. Join us over on Instagram. If you want to connect with other people that want to be motivated and inspired, you can follow me at the Sensational Social Hour. I'll put the tag and the link in the description box because I think that's correct. If you are a real one and you're still here, I appreciate you guys from the bottom of my heart. Thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. Leave the hidden word, lemon, in the comment section down below. Leave it in a funny, snarky, cute kind of way, and I'll feature some of you guys in my next video. Thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. I love you guys so stinking much. I hope you're all safe, happy, and healthy, and doing amazing, and I'll see you guys next time for another video. Bye, you guys.